everyone. My name is Jafet Ngoma. I'm age 22 years and I'm a business student at Creso University in my first year, second semester. I'm here to contest for Mr. Creso 2020. And reminding you, Zambian youths, us Zambian youths, Creso University youths, that we are all on a journey. A destiny that for sure will come to an end. Life is gonna pass with certainty. On this, we can depend. Time is on our side. Still we can decide what we leave behind because God is standing by. So tell me, what will be your legacy? As Zambian youths, as we'll be celebrating Youth Day on the 12th of March, what will be your legacy? Are you going to be people that will have impact in today's society? Are we going to be people that will have impact in our university? What will be your legacy? For me, Jafet Ngoma, my word of advice is that let us, be in, let us endeavor to be people that will have impact in our society today. Remember, this is Jafet Ngoma, Mr. Chris of 2020. What will be a legacy? Hi, I am Chilongo Sikarangi. Youth Day is a day where youths get to meet and interact with each other. This is a day when youths get to see the perspective of life and understand each other in a way that all the elderly cannot establish. I would like to thank all the youths for their efforts in our country and for what they do to believe in their dreams. I would like to thank the youths for understanding each other and interacting in a way that is possibly going to develop the country of Zambia. Hi, my name is Nancy Mulo Panyama and I am 23 years old. I just wanted to appreciate the Zambian youths all those youths that are taking an active part in the fight against HIV and AIDS and discrimination against those people living with HIV and AIDS. Also, I wanted to thank all those youths that are against uh, vandalism of uh, government properties and all those youths that are fighting so hard to see that Zambia is a better place for everyone else. And I want to wish each and every youth out there a happy youth day which falls on the 12th of March 2020. Hi, my name is Chipo Haziendo. This year we'll be celebrating Youth Day on the theme, Channeling Youth Power for National Building. This means using the power that we hold as youths in making the right decisions that will make our country grow. We are not leaders of tomorrow, but leaders of today. We can use the power that the youth hold in finding solutions that will, that will solve the problems that the country is facing right now. Let's not involve ourselves in negative vices such as alcoholism, drugs, and premarital sex. Instead, let's channel our ideas, time, and energy in finding solutions for social economic problems that the country is facing right now. I hereby encourage every youth out there to take part in the youth program that will make our country grow. Happy Youth Day. Um, my name is Arina Savoka. And I would like to commend the Zambian youths for their strength, their bravery, their tenacity. Because even when the odds have been against them, they have been fighting a good fight. Most of them have ventured into entrepreneurship, thereby creating jobs for their fellow youths. And they have sought opportunities where others have seen stubborn problems. They have contributed to the Zambian society positively and I believe that if they are empowered, they can do exploits. Remember, the Zambian youths are the future leaders of this nation and so they are supposed to be helped in any possible way to ensure that there is development in the country, especially in terms of economic development. celebrate and recognize the youths of a nation as the future leaders. In Zambia, Youth Day is celebrated on the 12th of March each and every year. On this day, 
Many youths gather together to engage themselves in various activities such as marching, sports, debate, poetry, and many more activities. As a proud Zambian youth, I urge and encourage each and every youth out there to be responsible, vision-driven, determined, and focused as we celebrate this year's big day. Thank you. Hello, Gloria Naomi Priyo here. One of the importances of Youth Day celebration is the evaluation of the Zambian youth's contribution to the development of the country. I would like to appreciate all the Zambian youths who are taking their time to put us on the world map through their hard work of innovation and inventions. Keep the fire burning. I would also like to take this time to uh, encourage each and every youth to take the lead and demonstrate your might and capacity to change this country and the world at large for the better. And please take out time to plant a tree to make a change. Remember, there's only one chance for you to be young, so make the most of it. The future is young. Hey everyone, my name is Afei Change Water. I'm one of the 2020 Miss Crystal University contestants. As we are celebrating this youth day, I just want you to know that we are not just leaders of tomorrow, but drivers of change today. Happy Youth Day to you all and stay blessed. Hi everyone, my name is Tatenda and yes, youth are a feature of a nation and Zambian youth are no exception. They have invested in their ability to create productive activities in social economical development of a country and scientific advancement in terms of safety, health and agriculture. Yes, youth are taking the lead. In coming up with different agendas, we have the likes of Messi Gondo. We have beautiful arts that she has created. In those arts, you are able to build a house on your own. Let's get motivated, guys. And I would like to appreciate our government that has supported us as youth by increasing a number of institutions like ours. And the youth have blossomed. So all is needed now is for us to awaken that giant in us and say, yes, we can do it. Thank you very much and have a better youth day. Hi, my name is Afeid Kualia. I'm here to appreciate the Zambian youths for everything that they are doing. To start with, Zambia isn't so developed, so we don't expect so much, you know, there's so many things going on. But regardless of all that, it looks like our Zambian youths are doing the most. It's surprising how we have business people, entrepreneurs that are so young and exceeding. We have models traveling so far and putting Zambia on the map. We have geniuses going to absurd universities, you know, getting scholarships. It's insane. We appreciate you so much because we see all these efforts. Everybody that's behind you is saying you can do it. Zambia can do it. Go ahead. Push on. We have your back. We see your work. You are really motivating us and we couldn't appreciate for any more than that. Thank you so much to every Zambian youth that's trying their very best to do the best that they can because we see you. We see your work. Enjoy your youth. Happy Youth Oriented. Hello, 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 hello. My name's um, Selmatha. Before saying anything, those are my names. I'm really, thanks, I'm really thankful for giving me this opportunity to say, to talk about Youth Day. Youth Day is the day that is observed to celebrate the youth in the society for their contribution to development. And uh, it also recognizes that the youth are future leaders. And because as youths, we are future leaders, we must be treated as such. <coughs> Uh, the few things that I'd like to say to my youth out there is that uh, as we celebrate Youth Day on 12th March, we are just not supposed uh, that day is not a mere day. It's a day that each and every youth must sit down, think what they live for, what they want in life. The past has nothing to do with you. No matter where you come from, the background, even if people treat you bad, they don't love you. They, they always criticize you. Don't listen to them. I advise my, my fellow youth out there not to listen to that because no one is going to take you to a successive learn apart from yourself. If you want to succeed in life, 
you need to be confident you need to you know what other people they throw that the the stones that go through at you ignore them you need to know that no matter what you do even if you do good things in life people always talk and because people always talk you need to know what you want in life and the purpose why you are created for Nelson Mandela fought for the this freedom that we have right now in Africa and because of Nelson Mandela this is the reason why we are here we are even happy don't if you want the world to know you you need to take a move wake up and take a move because if you take a move the world will know you if you sit back and relax the world will not know you if you want to be a great person in life you need to have a zeal you need to have a dream you need to be different each and every person was created for a purpose we're not just created for nothing to sit back and relax no if we sit back and relax as you and doing nothing if we die without achieving anything that means we have robbed our future generation what do i mean by robbing the future generation if you die today without achieving anything what if you achieved something who knows what you would have changed in the world who knows what people would have benefited from you so don't die with an empty hand die when you die make people make people remember you for the great thing you have done in your life economic and political contributions to the Zambian society since and before independence. So I would like to encourage each one of you youths out there in the celebration of the youth day. And in as much as we celebrate, you should always remember to be responsible and put God first in everything we do. Thank you very much. Hi, my name is Anisha Shampongo. Don't mind the way I'm looking. I'm not feeling too well. I'm going to talk about you. Um, young people are fantastic we need to know ourselves to understand others better the best gift you can give yourself is challenging yourself when someone does something nice you need to, you need to acknowledge that don't give up you are amazing give it your best you will get it next time you can you can do it challenges are meant to make you youth is not a time of life it is a state of mind you are as old as your doubt your fear your despair the way to keep young is to keep faith young keep your confidence young keep your hope young you are only young ones and if you work it right once is enough i want to appreciate all the young out there who are doing a good job by not giving up your mind your talent the creativity you bring to your life and the lives of the people you love when you learn to tap the source you have truly defeated age this platform I just want to appreciate the youths and share this acknowledgement that in this world there are a lot of problems and the challenges that the young ones are facing nowadays in order for them to get their way and therefore the world requires them to have these tradable skills that will enable them to solve all these problems these real life situations that they're going through out there and I also appreciate the young ones that have taken the responsibilities and young entrepreneurs that have started their own businesses for self-employment and help out their parents to put something on the table. And I may also encourage the young ones that there are no shortcuts in this world. There are no shortcuts in this world. There are a whole lot of responsibilities and a whole lot of opportunities for those that want to go ahead and try out new things. And this one calls for willingness and patience. That's all. Bimba Seo Imiti Kula Mpanga. And we are the trees, we are the young ones. We are the future. So we need to start up something. We need to build something. This is the foundation. We need to start up something. Thank you. Good morning. 
My name is Mulenga Chiza, coming from the Department of Health Sciences in Public Health. I'm going to talk about Youth Day. It's a theme that states, I take the lead. Well, why do we celebrate Youth Day? It is so done in the commemoration of the contribution of the youth to the Zambian society and how the youth can become more successful in their endeavors. Youth Day is an important day socially and politically. It helps the government reflect on how its effort is helping the youth curb their increasing problems which they face today. However, this day is used by the government to pass and institute special laws that helps the youth. Therefore, I stand as a youth, I speak as a youth, and I urge my fellow youths out there to be more productive and to be more positively productive in their everyday lives. Thank you. My name is Justine Tale, a student nurse at Crescent University. As we celebrate Youth Day, we should remember we are wise, intelligent, vigilant, multi-talented, and the future leaders of tomorrow. Our background is not a hindrance of who you should be. So you should be a person that can change the world. Get up, be strong, be bored, and know that you can change the world. Happy Youth Day. Hi, my name is Amuya Namasiku. As we all know, on Thursday 12th of March is Youth Day. Therefore, we as youths will be celebrating the significant roles we have played in the country as youths, which are participation, engagement, and advocacy that amplifies the youth's voices for the promotion of a peaceful, just, and sustainable country. Thank you. a BSc in nursing, second year, second semester, and 21 years of age. I would love to appreciate the Zambian youth for their great works and perseverance for a better future, and trying to stay away from harmful substances, rather concentrating on achieving their goals. Precisely, I'm grateful to the youth helping in the fight against early marriages and the spread of HIV. Therefore, I urge every youth to keep the hope alive for the bright tomorrow. Thank you. Have a wonderful youth day.